This is Justin Williams, you know, making another video. This video is go it's gonna be about uh, Pastor Troy. Of course if you don't know Pastor Troy, Pastor Troy is a rapper from Atlanta, Georgia, you know. He was born, you know, he's a rapper that that, that yells a lot, you know, he used his trademark, said, Uh huh. That's his trademark, you know, he's he he's been around for years, you know, he started this track for to Master P, you know, Miracle, Mystical, uh Hitman Seven and Sam, you know, host of others, you know, that I can't even think of. You know, I think Lil John, I can't get Lil John, he did this towards them and the host of others. You know, you know, he's a he's a rapper that yells a lot on his songs, you know. You know, he's a good rapper, you know, but he yells a lot, you know. His first album was called back in ninety nine because the song called Re Ready. That's a good song. I declare war. You know, that's the city that came out in nineteen ninety nine. Check that album out. You know, cause he was he was one of the first rappers that brought Atlanta to Crump. You know, I yeah I know Lil John did it, but you know, but Patrick Troy is like the second one that did it. So, but you know, Patrick Troy has been in the game for years. You know, he. He, he he's the rapper you you don't want to mess with. He don't play around, you know. You know he did stuff with Player Fly. You know he did stuff with him to this year and all of this. So he came out with see with Player Fly. You know he did a lot of stuff with Snoop Dogg. Dash. Cause I, I I I'm shocked that you know he did some with Snoop Dogg on on his album back in 2014. I'm very shocked, but hell, hell, what the heck, you know. You know, he came out with numerous of albums, you know, he he he's selling, you know, he's selling off top. He ain't like one of these other rappers out here on the mainstream today. You know, he's he, he he's not one of those guys from down south that are like that. You know. Pastor Troy is like one of my favorite Atlanta rappers from down south. I mean, he's like one of my favorite rappers from Atlanta. Because he speaks, he, he yells a lot, but he speaks the truth on, on his song. You know, you know he speaks raw. You know, he yells like it ain't nothing. You know, like that song called, um, I forget, it's one of his songs. It's one of his songs called, uh, I, I, can't, I, can't, I can't think of it off my head, but, Oh Father. You know, that's a good song there. I like the song Old Father. That's a that's one of the greatest songs from Pastor Troy. What he was talking about God and his father and all of that. You know, he talks about a lot of things. He writes about real life issues at the same time. He writes about killing and shooting and all of that, so but you got that set for who he is, but I love Pastor Troy, man. Pastor Troy is like one of my favorites of all time. I know, I know, I know I'm not making sense in this video, but he's like one of my favorites of all time. You know, he does it get bucks style. You know, he does it get bucks style. You know, get crunk and get bucks style. You know, and all this stuff. But he this he this miracle so hard on his um, come on that that bounce we need. You know. Pastor Troy did like two verses and Miracle did one. I think the second verse was Miracle. He did this song called Bounce with Pastor Troy featured on two verses. I can't believe it, man. I can't believe it. You know, Pastor Troy, Pastor Troy left Miracle hanging. He did Miracle, I think, on one of his songs. Because I think Miracle, the rapper Miracle, you know, don't uh, don't think that he was in his clip, but no. Pastor Troy got on Miracle. And, and I haven't really heard from Miracle since after that, so... He came, Miracle came out with three albums. I haven't heard from him since. I don't know what happened to Miracle. But if you tell me what Miracle is, you know, you know, um, tell me in the comments say whatever happened to Miracle, man. Because he, he, was, he, he was going hard, too. You know, he was a hardcore rapper, too. Miracle was. Miracle from Augusta, by the way, so. But this video is named about Pastor Troy. You know, he did Master P, too. I don't know what Pastor Troy and Master, Master P B was about, you know, because you know, I think Pastor Troy was talking about him, and I remember, I remember Master P 2000 album came out called Ghetto Posters. He he was talking about some guy. I think he was talking about Pastor Troy on his song. I think on his song. I think he was talking about Pastor Troy on Ghetto Post on one of his songs. Come on, I'm, I'm gonna bust this brain. 
something like that. But I don't know what Pastor Toy Master P B was all about. They, they were back in um I think they were back in ninety nine, I think. Ninety nine, back in the late nineties or two thousand, one of them. I think I think late ninety nine. I think. Late ninety nine, the late nineties when Pastor Toy came out with his debut album, back in ninety nine. So I think it happened one of those times. So you know, tell me what you think about the situation between Pastor Tour and Master P or Pastor Tour and Miracle or Pastor Tour and Mystical. Or Lil John or you know, or you know, a hitman stem this thing. You know, Pastor Tour done went went off with beef over the years. But you know, 'cause you can't nobody touch him. I think the only person that can touch him is play a flight because they did a CD together. You know, I was starting to get that CD but I've listened to some of the songs on YouTube, and the songs from Pastor Tour and Player Fly, you know, they go hard. You follow me? You can hear the song called Pastor, Pastor Crazy, Pastor and Player Fly. You know, that song right there go hard. I, I suggest you check it out, you know, Pastor Tour, Pastor and Player Fly, you know, or called Pastor Crazy. Check that song out if you get a chance. So, it, it's on Pastor Tour 2014 TV, by the way. So, go check it out for yourself. Go check out other songs that he did with Play or Fly. Check out other songs. Check out the the, the CD, the, the both CDs as well. Called War Warriors. Probably two and Play or Fly called War Warriors. Check that out, man. You know, if you ain't got the CD. I ain't got the CD, but, you know, check it out. Check the songs out for yourself. The songs go hard. You know, the songs go hard. You know, it's better than the CD that Predator did with Criminal Man. You know, that CD, it was okay, but it wasn't up to date, you know, it's a good C D though. You know, I'ma start I'ma start listening to that C D after I get through with this video. But, you know, Patrick Troy has been around for years. You know, he's been in the game since nineteen ninety eight. Patrick Troy has been in the game since nineteen ninety eight. You know, it's been about almost twenty years, you know, Patrick Troy has been in the game. You know, he's nobody to be touched with. If you if you try to diss him you know it's going to happen. Because I heard so many Pastor Tour diss songs over the years. You know, if you diss Pastor Tour, you know it's going to happen. He ain't going to play with you. He going to, you know what's going to happen. I, I ain't going to say the word. You know, you, you know what's going to happen. You know, Pastor Tour is like one of my favorites out there from Atlanta. But I mostly listen to Memphis rap, you know, because I've been listening to Memphis rap since the late 90s. You know, Memphis rap is like one of my favorites, you know, because I was born in Memphis. You know, I was born in Memphis, Tennessee. So, you know, I was raised in another southern state called Mississippi. So, you know, but Patrick Choi ain't nothing to play with. He he is not nothing to play with. In music or in real life, he's not nothing to play with. You know, but... That's that's how that's that's how, that's why I got to speak about it, you know, about Pastor Troy and all of this. So, but, but my other video is uploading called TFL and Self Motivation. But I'm gonna upload this video, this video period, you know, about Pastor Troy. I'm talking totally about saying I'm gonna do my I'm gonna do videos of what about. So, you know, <laughs> ain't nobody up top him, you know. I already did a video about rest in peace, the Lord, infamous and coop. You know, I did that video because. That video had about one like, so, you know, could you get, a, get my rest in peace and the Lord and Coop, you know, because they were like one of the good But This video about Pastor Troy, you know, there, there, there's no another Pastor Troy. There's no, there's no another Pastor Troy. No another Pastor Troy, man. There's no another one because he go hard like it ain't nothing. He goes hard. Like it ain't nothing. Cause can't nobody stop him. Can't nobody do nothing. The only one person that can stop him, I should say, is a uh, play or fly. I don't know about Mystico or or you know any other rapper. You know, but play or fly can. I I, I want to see that battle between play or fly and Pastor Troy. You know, cause I know they came out with a CD together called War Warriors. But I want to see them go at it. You know, Pastor Troy and play or fly. I want to see them go at it. See who gonna win? You know, who 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 will win between you know, Pastor Troy and Player Fly? Cause I know I know I know Destiny came out with the World Warriors. Who who you think will win between Pastor Troy and Player Fly? Who will win that battle? You know, tell what you think in the comments. 
do whatever you got to do, whatever, because there's no way you can stop Pastor Troy. Well, so he's like one of the goodest rappers out there that can spit a rhyme. You know, even though he hollers all the time when he rap, you know, can't nobody stop him. He's like one of my favorite rappers out of Atlanta right now. He's like one of my top number one. He's like number one to me. I got some of his CDs, but, you know, he's, he's number one from Atlanta. You know, but T-Rock is like number two. Um, number three is, um, is, uh, I uh, number three from Atlanta. It is, um, you, you might want to say it, but T.I., you know, he's like one of my, he's like number three. Number four is, um, is, um, that's it. I don't know anybody else from Atlanta. The Young G's is number four. And number five is, um, that's it, man. I don't know anybody from Georgia. Miracle. You know, Miracle. I'm going to say Georgia. I don't know for Atlanta, period. But, Pastor Troy is like one of my favorite number number one is Georgia rappers out there, you know, they can spit a rhyme. You know, but this all I got to say, you know, but he came out with multiple songs like We Read in Part One, Part Two. I think number one I like number one a lot better than number two because number one he went hard on Re Red. They been playing G A with Re Red in. They were back in ninety nine, you know, when he first did he came. I liked the first one a lot, but number two was okay. But number one is Bella. You know, I like this song called, well, he did a sample of Bill Goldberg's song. You know, you know that song called, uh, he, he sampled this song from Bill Goldberg. I forgot what it's called. But Patrick went hard on that Goldberg sample. He went hard on that Goldberg sample. Check that song out. You know, I forgot what song we sampled from Bill Goldberg. I forgot. But that song goes hard. You know, like like any other song, you know, that Patrick Troy did, you know, from, he did a song called, in 2001, We the City, We the City, We the City, uh-huh, I like that song, you know, check that song out for yourself, but, like I said before, you know, Patrick Troy is a good rapper from Atlanta, you know, but, check him out, you know, you might like some of his songs, you might get tuned up from it, but, but this is Justin Williams, you know, free free to rate, comment and subscribe, and tell what you think about Pastor Troy versus Player Five. Tell me what you think about Pastor Troy. But I'm out peace. Add me on Facebook, I'm out peace.